Hi guys, I'm going to be doing another cash stuffing video. This is going to be for my boyfriend and he had just received a very generous gift from his grandparents. He got $3,000 and they're just really amazing. They gave this to him because they knew that we were both struggling, struggling really bad because someone stole my Cadillac converter from my car. So they know that they knew that I needed to probably get a new one. And this was just to help us out for that. But like also that it was just a gift to help um him and stuff uh so i just think that they're just amazing like amazing amazing family he has an amazing family but um yeah i just want to get started before this video gets too long um we do share a car right now as of right now because his car had broken down and then when he got it fixed he just let his sister use it um for her to get to work she's 17 years old so um she just he just thought it would be a good idea for her to have like a starting off kind of car but yeah um i just wanted to show you guys uh like the his cash stuffing videos and i wanted to show you guys um what I got from an Etsy shop. I will link her um, Etsy shop down below, but I love this folder that I got from her. And it's so cute, and she gave me two, so I have the other one, I'm using it, but. And then she, I also got from another Etsy shop, this Costco one, and I'll link them down below too, because I wanted that, that was so cute. Um, I think it is always a good idea to save to go to Costco, and the reason why is because you always spend at least $200 there. So, at least I know I do, um, so yeah uh anything i don't spend in groceries will go straight into there but yeah let's get started this is the budget he got three thousand dollars right here and we'll get started so rent is getting nothing utilities is getting nothing down payment and deductible is getting something so it is getting five hundred dollars one two three four five and he and i are both moving into a two-bedroom apartment hopefully um knock on wood because i really want this to happen but um we are going to find a two-bedroom apartment to move into because we do not like the apartments that we are living in right now um they have horrible service here like um their manager takes like a long time before they even try to talk to their residents it's just not a good situation and i just don't like it i don't think it's worth it here um so i'm glad that we're moving soon in january the beginning of january because our lease ends in the beginning uh or in january 31st so we want to already be in the process of moving out in january like first um so we have weeks to really get into our place and stuff so yeah emergency fund he has currently 70 dollars because we just started his cash stuffing literally this week so that video should be out um but he's getting 300 dollars for his emergency fund um and so now he has 370 dollars in there and i always tell myself that emergency is a very high priority on our list to save up for so i'm really happy that he is now have at least a lot of money in there just in case something happens car maintenance he does not currently have a car right now he me and him are sharing my car so it's our car but he will be getting his car back because again we're moving so he is going to be having to get his car back because we won't be as close to his work like walking distance to his work so if he needs to go to work and i need to go to work then we're both screwed he's like he doesn't need my um like he doesn't need the car because but he uses it anyways because like you know i just don't like it when he walks because it i just feel like it's dangerous so i i tell him to just use my car because i just can't stand it like i want him to be safe but yeah so um 115 dollars is now in his um car maintenance in his um vacay oh did i already do down payment and deductible okay 
in vacay it's gonna get a huge chunk of this money because we are going on vacation soon um and we need to save at least a thousand six hundred dollars um each because we are both going to disneyland with our friend and it's just um better to have more than less and so yeah and anyways if like we chose to go somewhere else we can but I'm also saving 1,600. This is not for us, this is for him. Like his ticket, his share of things. Um, so yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So this is a thousand dollars is going into his vacay fund. And before we empty it out, like to put the one K slips and stuff, um, I'm going to have him like I'm gonna come with him to the bank and we'll I'll help him set up his um like accounts because um Again, I'll be telling you guys like in a separate video, like a bank account um, organization video um, to show you guys kind of how I do it and how I think he should do it as well because it's just opening up basically other savings accounts um, so that you have multiple savings account and you can organize it and label it the way you want on your phone so you know how much is in what. Um, that's kind of how I do it. So I think he should do it that way as well. But he is very close to being fully funded in vacay. That was a huge one. Um, but yeah, date night is getting $100. Um, so me and him, we don't really go out too often like on dates. But when we do, I want him to have money. And then I want to have money as well saved in mind. So that, because we will take turns and stuff. But at least he'll be ahead of the game. So like let's say in next week, like if he only got paid five hundred dollars because he missed a day of work um at least he will have a lot of things put into a lot of these um envelopes so in investments i will be putting two hundred dollars so one two so he'll be getting two hundred dollars in his investments he had already invested a lot of money like that's why i'm doing this for him because he had invested a lot of money already and that's where most of his money is going and i told him that he needs to budget for other things as well like i get the importance of investing and growing your money but i also think he should be very well in budgeting for bills like he needs to budget for any Thing that happens because the second you put that money into investments it's not like you can just pull it right out and if you do do that then there was no point in doing that so um i kind of want him to save for other things as well so he now has 250 dollars in investments in home he will be putting a hundred dollars um this is just for anything we need in the house. So now he has $115. This includes just really anything at all that we would need in the house. Um, it could, this could end up going into our Costco um, envelope, but um, it really depends. I kind of just want him to save up for that so that he can help me out sometimes too. Um, but again, like this home like is not a high priority on his list of things to budget for. So um, this actually will not be stuffed for that, like that much for a while. So I'm glad to be already kind of ahead in it now that, cause he has this extra money. Um, for phone, I don't think we're stuffing phone today. Um, for Senna, he is giving me $200 for um, Senna, and then he's giving me $200 for Holiday, or yeah, he's giving me $200 for Holiday, so that's, um, cause I put in $600 for Holidays, and he's putting in $200, and that's to, like, help buy like presents for his family and um kind of help buy the things that we need in the house like we are purchasing that smart tv that is for the both of us the vacuum is for the both of us just things like that and then i believe 300 dollars goes into his credit card so um starting next year or starting 
soon he will be stuffing this on his own so he has his own share of savings for holidays so he doesn't have to mix it with mine but because we started this so late that's why we're already mixing ours but yeah that is all that is in his binder it's already feeling a little thick but yeah i'm really happy that he allows me to do this because seriously like i do have like a niche niche about it like i'm actually like super like into doing this kind of stuff so yeah but yeah thank you guys so much for watching and um stay tuned for next week and like i'll have more vlog videos posted um so yeah thank you guys please like and subscribe and um stay tuned for the next videos